Uh, Chris, congratulations. New two-year deal, so it takes you up to the end of 2019. You must be delighted. Yeah, I am. I'm, I'm, I'm pleased that it's all been, um, all been finally sorted. It's been uh, quite easy negotiations with, with, with Michael and myself and uh, pleased to get something um, signed on the dotted line and pleased to be able to coach this side for another further two years. How far do you feel they've come so far? I think we've come. A, I think we've come a long way. There's still a lot of progression to be made, both on the, on and off the field. Um, but I think the, the the quality that we've brought in this year has really, you know, has really really helped the the, the squad. And um, you know, things are ticking along nicely. We we've won three from us as last four games. We've we've had a little bit of a blip, obviously, against uh, Leeds, but we certainly think that we're going in the uh, in the right direction. What's it like? I guess, obviously, as a player, is it different to when, as a coach? You know, when you're waiting for a new contract or looking for one, or we always confident this was just a matter of dotting the eyes, crossing the teeth. Um, no, we never. <laughs> you never. You're never confident in in, in rugby league. Um, but it's always. Uh, uh, we 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 said when I took over, when I spoke to Michael, that we'd discuss it in in, in March, and we'll see how the rest of you know last season went and how we, how we start this season and. You know, we've started okay. We've started okay. Like I said, there's been there's been one little blip, um, but yeah, it's it's really really pleasing to to have something signed on the dotted line, and uh, you know, really pleased to commit my future to these to this club. And um, I guess, oh, sorry, and I guess when you're talking to players and now, and they know you're going to be here for a set period of time, I guess it makes it a little bit easier for them as well, does it? Yeah, you... I, th- I think so. I think so. We we're talking to the uh, the, the present squad now, uh, re- you know, retention and. There's a few that have asked if I'm going to be, you know, still be still be around, which is nice. And um, you know, I'm pleased to say that I am going to be around. And uh, you know, I'm loving my time here. I've had a been a, a breath of fresh air uh, for me here. And you know, I learnt a lot of things from my uh, from my past experiences at Hull Kingston Rovers. And and I think I've learned from, learnt from them and and come out the end of, uh, the other end of a better coach for it. What's your aim then during your time here at Wakefield? What's the plan now then? Three years to to look forward to. Well, we've got to be we've got to be consistently fighting for that uh, that that top eight spot, and we we achieved that last last season. Uh, we've certainly got the players to to achieve that this year, but we've got to be you know we've got to be a, a consistent football side, and we've got to get things right off the pitch as well to uh, for the for this club to to move forward. And you know if we can get get the things right off the field, then uh, you know it gives us a little bit more money to spend on it and. Um, you know, there's there's no re- we've got a really good core of fans here, a really good fan base, and there've been nothing but supportive of this uh, of of this club. And you know, we've got a fantastic chairman and vice chairman in in, in Michael and, and and Chris that uh, are working really hard behind the scenes um, to push this club push this club forward. But we all know what the stumbling uh, the stumbling block's been for for a number of years. And uh, you know, the sooner that issue is sorted out, the the better for everybody, I think. But I guess your faith in them has been shown by the fact you're happy regardless to commit to this club anyway. Yeah, I'm a Wakefield lad. It's a, it's a dream come true for me to to coach this side. It's uh, it's a club that I've always supported as a as a kid. I've been a season ticket holder here for for quite a few years when I was younger. Um, so yeah, it was an easy an easy decision for uh, for for me to to resign and. I'm really pleased and proud that I've got the opportunity to to lead this club forward for another two years.